Hey, welcome back to the Radio Garage. We got a DX979 on the bench today. And this one uh, comes in with a pretty good problem. Um, does not transmit or receive. So, um, yeah, I'd say, I'd say that's definitely got to get taken care of. Um, I just powered it on. Um, a lot of times when I get a radio, when it gets on my bench, it doesn't do the problem that it... Uh, comes in for so I just verified that it is doing what the uh, customer said not transmitting or receiving so um, as you could see uh, receive transmit light doesn't switch so I mean there's a dead giveaway right there um, we got a switching problem so uh, you know uh, the only other thing I would do is just make sure make sure that my mic was making good contact before uh, yeah, still nothing. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to open the covers and uh, we'll check for some obvious stuff first and go from there. Alright, we're back. We have a uh, transmit now. So, problem was bad solder joints. Um, specifically um, around the PLL area um, over here and got them uh, reflowed and she seems to be working good um, I don't know if once it cools down I'm gonna check it again because uh, it is it is warm now so I don't know if temperature is gonna play a factor but let's just see what it's doing so we are going to put a um, an audio tone into it yeah this one's this one's just like the rest of them. Yeah, it's really, really wide open. So, that's what we got going on there. All right, so I figured you could see better if I just took the camera off the stand. Um, if anybody could tell me, what the heck do you call this? A slinky? Look, what? What the hell is this? Somebody took somebody took this uh, this inductor coil and you know, and, and made like a made like a sculpture out of it or something. I don't know what they were trying to do. Oh my goodness! What do you think of that? Wow. Wow. Oh, man. All right. But everything else does uh, look fine in here. Like uh, the main uh, Q39 here, modulation limiter is uh, still there. So I don't really see any other, you know, stuff clipped. So we just have that one coil we got to watch out for. All right. I did get that coil uh, straightened out best I could, so you could see it there now. Yeah, that's best I could get it, and it's perfect on the spectrum analyzer. So, whoops, I already checked it on the spectral purity. So, not gonna have a problem. We got it straightened out. All right, and here's your uh, AM frequency. We got it all lined up. 27205005, close as I could get it. Of course, it's going to drift too, so um, yeah, that's where it's at now, though. So we're getting there. All right, we got her all done. Oh, we're really banging them out now. So let's uh, do the transmit here quick. I got her hooked up to the um, service monitor. I'm going to throw the tone into her, show you to on the scope. It stays linear. Yep. Okay. And then uh, let's see what she's doing on the meter. 50 watt slug, of course. Let me get the switch box out. I'm going to put the mic in. One two three four five 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 four 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 five 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 four. 
So about 25 watts, give or take. Show you the spectrum analyzer. I did get that coil situated um, that was um, strung out like a slinky. So just hook that in there. Come over to uh, our spectrum. And I got it set up right now for 60, uh, 60 megahertz. Okay. See that one, two, three, four, five. And then uh, I'll take it down. To uh, 100. Whoops. Band is a hundred kilohertz. Beautiful. Well, five megahertz. Fifteen megahertz. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Thirty. One, two, three, four. And we'll do sixty. Oh wait, I did 60 already. 1, 2, 3, 4. We'll do 150. We'll end with 150. 1, 2, 3, 4. 1, 2, 3, 4. Alright, so that's done. Uh, let's pop it on the receive here quick. Alright, here she is on the receive. Get this out of the way. Take that off. Turn this on. So, uh... Let's see, here's 73. All right. Here's our S9. I had the RF gain down, so I was wondering why that wasn't uh, picking up right. Okay, what did I do? There we go. Okay. Here's your S9. Perfect. All righty. And then we'll see where she drops out at. Um, this had a nice receiver on it. It really did. These are nice radios, these 979s. Nice size, size of which Cobra 29. Yeah, 110, negative 110. So, see that there, and then you can see bottom, bottom left. Oh, she's actually, well, she's bouncing around a little bit, but yeah, 13 or so. Okay. Um, so that's the receive. Um, what else did I want to show? I do it over the air test quick. I think that's going to be it. All right, here we go. Um, I'm going to do over the air audio. It's coming out of the uh, the new monitor speaker there, right there. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, and five. Okay. And now we'll do. Uh, Let's take it to sideband. We'll show you that she's on frequency. Lower sideband. Now I gotta just uh, put the George on lower. Okay, now the George is on lower. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, and five. So she's all set. All right. Um, yeah, so got her all straightened out. She's running good. Um, she's dead nuts on frequency, AM and sideband. Uh, Receive came out great. Nice, uh, nice little compact single final radio. Can't beat these guys. So uh, I do have. Let's see, what do I got going on with the shop here? I got a new, um, I got a new meter coming. Uh, I'll show. You, I'm going to be doing a video on that. And also, I'm already um, I'm already sick of this new power supply, the B and K Precision. I thought it was good at first, and now the damn thing is uh, putting out uh, RFI, EMI type uh, interference and noise. I'm it's just I can't win with these switching these switching mode um, power supplies. I said I was going to get an Astron. I should have got the Astron. So you know what? I'm going to get the Astron. Or a trip light, big old, big tank of a 
of a linear power supply. Screw it already. So, anyways, all right. Enough of me uh, going off there. So, um, Tom, appreciate it. I'm going to uh, touch base with you. We'll get this one uh, sent back out to you. And uh, everybody stay tuned. Appreciate it. The Radio Garage, we're off the key.